it's just her voice like shining through doing so much in terms of tone in terms of pitch in terms of stamina and, and the actual sound of a belting hello everyone welcome to another video reaction here of bliss today we're coming back to emma on this occasion with helen fisher in the comments that you you were talking about her and as always i've been reading it trying to find new suggestions and here we are i found that she did a version of voila with her and I'm super curious I'm very excited to listen to this so Helen Fitcher and Emma Cock voila Écoutez-moi Voilà chanteuse à demi Parlez Dis-moi à vos amours à vos amis parlez-le this it feels you know it is so rêve fou mon ce que je veux c'est écrire des histoires qui arrivent jusqu'à c'est tout it's amazing how the way she whispers music is normally a reason for any singer to lose control of the actual tone of the voice but in her it sounds so cozy and so close and it's very well controlled the pitching and the tone and the way she conveys the text when she says écoute moi that i actually listen so that's that means listen to me and i everything that is in my head until that point her dress the orchestra everything that could ever distract me it just kind of goes and concentrates and her voice just because of how convinced and how determined she is in those few notes that she just sings voila, 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 voila qui je suis mais voila mes messieurs mes années japon oui mais voila tout le prix et tout le silence notice how she sings voila so she goes full into the legato and then she takes it back kind of suddenly that effect works so well voila, voila. like is that perfect a uh, two note slur there works fantastic Faut dire que le lèvre est inan, traînez-vous diront pas. C'est peut-être chance mais moi, tout ce que j'ai, je le dépose là. Voilà. How on earth didn't I know about this amazing singer? This is the first time I why? I don't understand why have I missed this? Her voice is fantastic, tone-wise, it's beautiful, she has a beautiful natural tone, but you can see that not only she has an amazing technique, but she has experience. The way she plays with the sound, the place she gives and takes, is fantastic, and then she gives you the very beautiful round belting that, that is, is so cozy, and it's very rounded, it's kind of like in between what would you find in classical music and what would you find in popular music and it's so well placed and the vibrato is so wavy and beautiful amazing 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 i wanted to remind you that here at bliss we not only react to amazing artists singing amazing songs we also teach piano and singing and we are offering a free taster all you need to do is to click on the link in the description box and then you will be brought to our website when you can select what type of tasters you would like to do. You can select from singing to musical theatre to piano and then select at the time and the day that suits you best and we're going to see you on the other side. Voila, 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 voila que je suis, mais voila mes missing, mes années c'est fini, c'est mes gueules, c'est mon cri. Mais voilà, tant pis. Voilà, 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 juste ici. Mon amour et ma vie, comme je griffe, comme je ris. Mais voilà, tout le prix. Et tout le silence. There is 
a difference. You could see that the way Helen sang this chorus, it was so beautiful. It was sound wise, it's a beautiful, beautiful sound. But I somehow, and please don't be mad at me for this, but I feel that she was playing it safe. She was. She knows how to sing a note. She knows how to deliver this. How to go back and forth in the melody. But she. She knows that she's. She's thinking with it with logic with you know, conscious. When when this little thing, she sings that. I mean, she is fifteen years old, right? Thirteen, fifteen. The way she just sings is. It, I mean, she has the natural talent, but I don't feel she's thinking about it. I think she's just singing from her heart, and that gets to me. It gets to me, and it probably gets to you, the way she just sings the exact same melody line, and the way she goes through it, it's just pure heart, and it just resonates like a bang in my head. Ne partez pas Je vous supplie, restez longtemps so much heart. Ça me sauvera très pas, non. Me faire se faucher pas comment. Aimez-moi comme un ennemi qui se va pour toujours. Je veux quand même, parce que moi je sais pas bien aimer mes grands Dans le bruit et dans le fur aussi. Regardez-moi fort et mes yeux et mes moi. Tout ce que je dessine, c'est mes cœurs, c'est mon cri. Mais voilà, mais voilà, mais voilà. to carry and to lead so much that was going on there her passion is so big that just absorbs everyone in that in that place the audience the orchestra this amazing singer this is was an amazing it's, Helen features you can see but everything she does the way she delivers her vocals the little details like when she goes Voila! And then she just takes that back. Is is she's amazing, but then nothing compares to the way Emma moves, the way she sings, the way her notes sound. There was so much power. She was leading everyone in that room. She was leading with her voice. Her voice is powerful. Like you can see, out of everyone, she was probably the youngest out of everyone that is actually making music in there. 
but there is so much it's like she could carry herself if music were 20 horses she could carry them all with her voice she will lead everyone she would just carry everything because it is she has a very powerful voice but her passion makes her just shine in a way that is so different it is so powerful it's so mesmerizing it's so unique there is i mean i myself i actually i i need to listen to all the versions so, so all the singer singer in voila because i i heard the, the song for the first time on her voice but i don't think there will ever be the song and then other other interpretations and other performance and renditions of the song without thinking about about emma's voice in that song this song was written for her i have no idea when this was written but whoever wrote the song either knew that was for a voice like her or didn't know and this is just one of those amazing surprises that life brings to you it is it is then like look at this like you cannot tell me that she is not leading everyone with her movement with her face with her voice just look at everything She just I mean you can't think about anything else when you're listening to her voice you can't it's just her voice like shining through doing so much in terms of tone in terms of pitch in terms of stamina and, and the actual sound of her belting but that particular tone of voice that 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 stamina that very particular sound timbre of her voice is something that was one with her and then on top of that you have her chiming through over uh helen and over the orchestra it's just her voice like an umbrella of light and then everything else amazing amazing emma amazing as always i mean i wasn't expecting any i wasn't expecting anything less but at the same time i wasn't expecting her to surprise me the way she surprised me and definitely knowing um helen i mean it's fantastic i'm definitely going to react to something so i would i, I will definitely i will definitely look at other stuff by her because I mean, she has an amazing voice with amazing technique and, and, and it's very pleasant to listen to. <sighs> Thank you, life, for this video and uh, today's uh, experience. I live for these things. Like, if you don't have these things to enjoy, life is pretty pointless. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful thing. I hope you have a lovely day and I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye.